Ever wondered how many galaxies are out there in the universe? Well, let's delve into the enigma of galaxies, a topic as expansive as the cosmos itself. Galaxies, simply put, are vast systems of stars, gas, and dust, bound together by gravitational forces. They are sprinkled across the universe in such abundance that astronomers estimate there could be as many as two trillion of them. Yes, you heard right, two trillion galaxies, each home to millions, billions, or even trillions of stars. Now, not all galaxies are alike. They come in a variety of shapes and sizes. Some, like our own Milky Way, are spiral galaxies, with arms of stars swirling out from a central core. Others are elliptical galaxies, more round or oval in shape. Then we have the irregular galaxies, those cosmic rebels that refuse to fit into any predefined shape. Imagine, all these galaxies, each with billions of stars, just waiting for us to explore. Did you know that our very own galaxy, the Milky Way, is a spiral galaxy? Envision a grand cosmic pinwheel, with arms spiraling out from a glowing, dense hub. This is the structure of the Milky Way, our celestial home. The heart of this spiral, the galactic center, is a compact region teeming with stars, dust and gas, all swirling around a supermassive black hole. Stretching out from this lively center, we find the spiral arms. These curving pathways are not just for show, they're star-forming powerhouses where new stars are born from clouds of gas and dust. And speaking of stars, the Milky Way is a bustling metropolis, hosting an estimated 200 to 400 billion of them. So what makes the Milky Way a spiral galaxy? It's all about the shape, those signature curving arms spiraling out from the center give the Milky Way its classification. Our Milky Way, a beautiful cosmic whirl, spinning in the vast expanse of space is just one among billions. What if I told you that the largest galaxies in the universe aren't spirals but ellipticals? Yes, you heard it right. The celestial giants of the cosmos are not the spirals like our Milky Way, but the ellipticals. So what exactly are these elliptical galaxies? Picture a vast, three-dimensional spheroid teeming with stars, dust and dark matter. These galaxies are often round but can also be quite elongated, almost like a rugby ball. You won't find any new stars being born here as elliptical galaxies are typically filled with older red stars. This is a stark contrast to the lively blue star-forming regions in spiral galaxies. Elliptical galaxies are true behemoths. They range from dwarf ellipticals, which are similar in size to globular clusters, all the way up to giant ellipticals, which can contain over a trillion stars. The most massive known elliptical galaxy, IC 1101, stretches about 6 million light-years across, dwarfing the Milky Way. Now how do these ellipticals differ from their spiral counterparts? The key difference lies in their structure. Spiral galaxies have a flat, disc-like structure with arms winding out from the center, whereas ellipticals lack these distinct features. They are more like a giant, globular swarm of stars. These massive, star-filled spheres remind us of the incredible diversity of galaxies in our universe. Each one, whether it's a spiral, an elliptical, or an irregular, tells a unique story about the cosmos. Not all galaxies fit neatly into categories. Meet the irregular galaxies, the universe's oddballs. In the vastness of the cosmos, irregular galaxies are the rule breakers. They refuse to conform, sporting unstructured and chaotic shapes instead of the well-defined spirals or elliptical forms we see in their more orderly counterparts, these cosmic mavericks are the rebels of the universe. Some of the known irregular galaxies include the Large and Small Magellanic Clouds, our Milky Way's closest galactic neighbors. These galaxies are a wild, chaotic dance of stars, gas, and dust. They are like abstract paintings, each one unique, their forms shaped by the cosmic ballet of gravity and time. But why are these galaxies interesting to astronomers, you might ask? Well. Their chaotic nature can provide valuable clues about the universe's past. They often exhibit signs of intense star formation, suggesting they could be in the early stages of their evolution. This makes them invaluable for studying how galaxies form and evolve over time. Moreover, irregular galaxies are often rich in gas and dust, the raw materials for new stars. This makes them vibrant, dynamic environments where new stars are constantly being born, providing us a front-row seat to the stellar life cycle. The irregular galaxies with their chaotic forms add a touch of mystery to our understanding of the cosmos. In the grand scheme of things, every galaxy has a role to play. Like instruments in an orchestra, each galaxy, 
whether it's the swirling spiral of our Milky Way, the massive ellipticals with their aged stars, or the chaotic irregulars, contributes its unique note to the cosmic symphony. They are not just vast collections of stars, gas and dust, they are the birthplaces of stars and planets, the crucibles of creation. They dance through the eons, sometimes alone, sometimes in pairs or groups creating a ballet of cosmic proportions. Their interactions, collisions and mergers create stunning vistas of cosmic artistry. They are the universe expressing itself in grand scale, a testament to the beauty and diversity of existence. Remember every star you see in the night sky is part of a galaxy, and there are billions more out there, each with their own story to tell.